on this video I'm going to be showing you export to the um, chirp system um, I've never done a video for this one um, I don't have a radio which will allow me to use chirp but I do know how to, to, to operate it so I'm going to do a search for frequencies I know they're all the same I'm not bothered what uh, um, material goes in I'm just going to show you because an example so we've got 13 results there so I'm going to press chirp export and that's going to open a window for me now there's 13 frequencies in there I'm going to press select all because I want them all in and I'm going to press add selected to database so I'm just going to put all 13 in there as you can see it's named on as location as 13 up to 13 I'll show you why well you don't need to do anything else now if you open it again it will rewrite that chirp um, uh, CSV folder so you don't want to just leave it open now you want to open your chirp so we'll just wait for the chirp to open it's probably kind of come up with a, a warning I think it did earlier right okay so if you didn't so I'm going to click file and I'm going to press open now the file for this one is a little bit difficult to do because um, you've got to locate it so what I do here to do it dead quick is press open saved CSV folder so in a moment it will open up and you can copy and paste the CSV folder so you'll see it there chirp database WTR so I'm gonna copy this probably isn't the best way to do it and see so copy and I'm gonna put that on the desktop so it's easy to find computer's running really slow okay so I'll paste that right so now I'm gonna click desktop and I want to find that chip start typing it in chirp database there we go so you press open and you'll see in a second that all the 13 channels will uh, automatically insert into the chirp program oh, sorry it was already minimized right don't worry about these tones and that they do automatically right so you want to click on the radio here and you want to press upload to radio now I haven't got a radio connected so it's greyed out but that's as simple as it is now you need to really back up your radio before you write to it I'm not going to be held responsible for any of your losses so download your code plug first save it then add whatever you want at your own risk. Okay, thank you.